But it feels like I'm like in a magical forest or something. I don't know. I just picked this cool spot. I'm here at Biscayne Park, by the way. I am actually so over it at this point. I just stopped giving a fuck about views, you know, analytics, subscriber count. I'm just grinding. You know, I'm just posting videos, and if people like it, they like it. If they don't, it's whatever. I have nothing but love in my heart, but I feel like I make, you know, content that's better than most people's content now. And I'm just thinking, like, why is my content... Like, why? Why? Like, what is it? What am I not doing right? You know, I'm being consistent. I've been posting. Like, what is actually going on? Okay, I'm so sorry, bro. This squirrel is distracting me, man. Look at this guy. He's just eating. I thought he was choking for a second because he was like, he did like, like did that or something. I don't know what was going on, but he's just eating an acorn or something. Okay. Is YouTube even possible? Like, is it just down to luck? Is it just down to just having just the right timing, the right idea, just, what is it? I don't know. I've been making some really good videos, and the craziest part is, okay, I'm gonna just say this now. I've had videos that look like they were about to blow up, like literally they're getting like crazy click-through rate, crazy, crazy average view duration, crazy everything, and it skyrockets to like a thousand plus views, and then all of a sudden, nothing. It is not like the analytics got worse or the video just magically got worse. No, it's like the average view duration is still high. Click the rate is still high. It just, there, there's no views. I don't know what's going on. I don't know, like, like, how does the video just blow up randomly and then just stop? Like, no views. I don't get that. I don't get that. And then, yeah, the comments, you go to the comments, people are resonating with it. I love this video. Oh, my God, this is crazy. Best video I've ever seen. You're my favorite YouTuber. And you're just sitting there like, why aren't these videos doing better what in my what do i need to do who do i need to talk to do i need to talk to susan is susan still in charge i don't know i'm emotionally just drained i just i'm tired i've i've worked so hard i still work so hard and the thing about it is it's not even the work itself it's just the uncertainty of success because you know if someone would have told me or if someone would tell me right now ty in three years you are guaranteed success with this amount of videos, with this amount of time, with this amount of months posted, you are guaranteed success. I, there would be no quorums. I wouldn't even care about this. They, they can say 10 years. That's a long ass time. You know, I ain't gonna lie to you. That's a fucking long time. But just to know that it's certain makes it so much just alleviating. Like, just the uncertainty of, like, will I make it? Like, these videos are amazing. People are telling me that my videos are amazing. I have the personality for it. They'll blow up. But what if it doesn't? Like, what if? And I used to think that hard work and talent used to win and will prevail, but nowadays it's, it seems like the worst of the worst get famous. Like, Hakta, no hate to nobody. Like, I have no hate. You know, I'm saying, like, shout out to her, do her thing. But, but let's be honest, she got famous for saying, spit on that thing, Hakta. Like, that's what she got famous for. She's not really a celebrity, but you know what I mean. Like, she's a known figure, a known personnel from just saying hot to Jack Doherty, this guy, I don't even know what he's famous for, apparently he does OnlyFans but his fan base is kids I, I, these are the people that's in media these are the people that's famous, these are people that make it these are the people that's trending and it's inspirational, these are the people I'm making videos busting my ass, talking about important things talking about loving yourself, learning, learning how to find confidence and just work hard and become somebody different. And you're telling me those are the kind of people that's making a name for themselves. I don't get it. Like, at this point, I don't know. Maybe I need, do I need to switch up my content and just make it so just surface level? Just talk about the, just the mundane that nobody, that everybody knows, but it's just a trend. Like, I don't want to do that. I always get told like, Ty, you can make your videos so much simpler. You know, if you, you can post every single day, posting every day, that's the way to do it. And you know, granted, I get like more content, the better. Like the more times you post, the more chances you have of, I guess, blowing up. But the videos I like to create are like a work of art for me. You know, I love, I love to edit. I love putting my creativity into the YouTube. Like, I, don't, I guess for some people, YouTube is just just a job for them. But for me, YouTube is another way to express myself and show my creative side because I've realized recently that I'm actually a creative person. Like for the longest time, you know, I, I, I didn't really think about it, I guess, but when I really think about it, I'm actually creative. Like I 
enjoy creating something new. I'm not just a consumer. Most people enjoy the new trend or what's popping, but I don't care. Like, I want to create something of my own, something new, something original, unique to me. So when people tell me to post every day or post three times a day, I'm like, yo, how can I do that and still keep my editing and my quality the way I want it? I can't, it's impossible. I have to keep that creative side. I love editing, I love, you know, putting my spin on it. Like, this video, yes, this is me sitting here talking, but the way I edit it, the way I put it together, it's my own vibe, it's my own, I don't know, like, it's my own atmosphere. Through every video, I try to create a certain feel. Now, I want you to feel like we're friends or family or we just we just here talking. I don't want it to feel artificial or forced or fake. No, I'm just a normal guy talking about things. That's what YouTube is missing. Normal people just talking about normal things. I'm so tired of seeing Lambos and yachts and Bugattis. Like, can we get away from that? That's not normal. That's not real life. <sighs> 2020, the year of uh, Andrew Tate and you know red pill and get to the money get to the bag and all of that it made people want money so bad and of course i want money too don't get me twisted like i, I don't want to be broke but it made people want exuberant wealth like they wanted lambos and yachts and a private jet like what the fuck a private my, my, my guy where are you going in a private jet where are you going in a private jet am i crazy like people were telling me they wanted private jets and want to make millions a year like why why and go where i don't know and you know a lot of people start youtube because they think it's an easy way to get rich and if you haven't figured out by this video by now it's not easy it's not easy you know what you're watching my video i make at least in my opinion really good videos and i i really i really try i really trust me i don't just say that i really try and just dissect are my videos actually good? Am I actually entertaining? Can I actually speak? Am I talking to the people? You know, what could be wrong? And you know, I think recently I figured out that I wasn't being as human as I should. I feel like now I'm more, I'm more connected with you guys. Like I feel like I'm talking to you right now. So like, I think that's, that's a good change I've made. But other than that, like, I think my videos were great. You know, I, I had great thumbnails, great titles, good topics. It's just, you know, you, I don't know, I don't know. Right now I'm at 2K subscribers, so by the time this comes out, I don't know where I'm at. You know, one of these videos I post before this, because I got a lot of videos posted, uh, recorded, because I just been, bro, I've been, I've been so into content creation right now. I love it. Uh, so by the time this comes out, who knows? I could, this could come out when I'm at like 50K, and people are like, Ty, what are you talking about, YouTube is hard? You're doing really good. When I recorded this, guys, I'm only at 2,000 subscribers. Matter of fact, let me look at the exact number. Uh, 2,000. 40, you can't see that, hold on. Hold on, I'm gonna click off. You're gonna click off, Arnie. Do you click off? There it is, 2,043 subscribers currently. And I did change my uh, my profile pic. I wanted to fit more of me. I feel like my old one was kind of like kiddish. Like, bro, okay, I'm 22. Like, like Todd, grow up, like, what are you doing? Bro, okay, I, I, I stood up and this kid is literally just watching me because he sees me with the camera. He's gonna come over here, isn't he? Yep, nope, he's bouncing the ball. He's trying to look cool. You know, kid, do your thing. Let me show you. Can you see? Can I? I don't want to like. Yeah, look at him. He's just. He's trying to look cool and stuff. Hey, kid, do your thing, man. You got big dreams. You know, my biggest dream, bro, since I was 12, was to be a YouTuber. And, you know, I've, of course, I made gains. Like, I'm not even saying that, like, I'm doing bad. Like, this video is not to complain. Like, I'm very happy where I'm at right now. I just recently got monetized. I'm doing great. But it seems like, you know, I'm putting in hella effort, hella work. And people that's like not even trying, just doing just the most bare minimum effort, just whatever they can, whatever, just throw, throw it together. And that's getting millions of views, millions of like, like, likes, like Sophie Rain, but like she don't even dance. Like what do people, she don't dance, she can't dance. Like people are tuning into this and they'll leave, like, who cares, who cares, who cares? That's the, that's how society, that's how bad society has gotten. Like, we got to the point where, you know, we got to the point where, like, good content, I'm not even trying to, like, boost my head up. I'm, I just genuinely think I just make really good content. Like, people tell me, you know, comments. I just, that's what, sometimes you got to have a confidence about yourself. I think I make really good-ass videos. And the fact that, like, I'm sitting here fucking scrapping for the bottom and you got neon. 
I'm sorry. I'm, I'm saying a lot of names. You know, if this if, if I ever do blow up, they never want to work with me. They'd be like, Todd, remember that video you did a year ago? Fuck you. I don't like you. Hey, I wouldn't even want to work with them anyways, bro. Like, a lot of people... I made a video... I got to make a full video on this. But meeting celebrities in real life, bro, interesting experience. Um, my God. You know, just makes you realize that they're just normal people. And I don't even really want to... I don't even really want to work with these kind of people. Like, I want to be a YouTuber, but, like, it's going to get to the point where... I don't even want to collab with anybody because why would I like because like so many people are here just so weird like bro just uh, I don't know man I don't know they like, just act so different from off camera it's so crazy all I'm gonna say is is YouTube even possible in 2024 people let me know you know I'm just tired of, tired of I feel like I'm putting in so much effort for no gains I can't say no gains, you know, I want to say thank you guys for watching because you guys have been here since, a lot of you guys are new, but some of you guys have been here since the beginning and, you know, just the fact that I can even talk to anybody is amazing. So I don't want to, I don't want this video to seem like it's hate or I'm complaining. I guess I'm complaining a little bit, but overall, I'm happy. I'm happy where I'm at because I am growing, you know, I'm growing faster and faster. So eventually, you know, over a long enough time span, I will be somewhere. Just will take a long time, but you know I am happy. I'm okay where I'm at. Uh, thank you guys though. Thank you for putting me here. I'm in Miami. I'm living my dream life, technically. You know, Miami. Just here on a random Tuesday. You know, just at the park, feeling good, looking good, as I should. <laughs> that was cheesy as hell. I'm sorry. Love you guys so much though. I'm see you in the next video. Um, be good. And if you are a YouTuber out there, good luck. I know it's hard. I know it's hard. I might make some videos on some tips, even though I'm not the biggest YouTuber, but I do know some things. I love you guys. Peace.